Hello again, it's Megan. I have one more unboxing to do today. Um, I feel it and it feels like there are two in this packaging. So let's unwrap it. Yep, there's one box there. So it looks like they just wrapped them both uh, um, separately and then they kind of taped them together. All right, so. Oh, one and I'm just gonna get this dusty package off of my table here. So they are a little crushed again. <clears throat> this one feels kind of heavy actually. Oh, come on. There we go. Let's see. Okay. We got Might be multiples because I see two, two standard tray, standard pen, baggies, wax, and tweezers. So this must be square. I don't think they send um, tweezers with round beads. Oh my gosh, this is so tight. That's what she said, right? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, but wow. Okay, that was a snug fit inside there. Oh my gosh. I just got a peek at what they are. All right. This is going to be amazing, you guys. So, as you probably know, um, I'm a Harry Potter fan. And... Um... <clears throat> By the way, in my last video when I unboxed this owl, I was I showed you my work in progress, my um, first Harry Potter whip, and I call it <laughs> I call it a stitch. What I meant to say was snitch. So sorry about that. Anyway, <clears throat> I think okay. So I ordered more Harry Potter ones. Um, I said I was going to do a like a Harry Potter wall in my house. <laughs> Look at all this white already. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Every time I see this much of one color it still overwhelms me even though I've been doing it and it's been going quickly and it's fine. Um, but you know what I wonder? You know, for 310 for blacks, they do like a five, like a jumbo bag where it equals five of these little bags. I wonder why they don't do that for white too. Maybe they just don't make them. So this one is bigger. I see lots of, oh, there are, there's some 310s in here. There's some black. Um, there's a lot of different colors in here, you can see, um, this one must be bigger, and it is, it's a 60 by 50, and it is going to be Hogwarts, the castle where they go to school, Hogwarts, um, there's a lot of different versions of this, but I think I liked this one the best because you can see a lot of the detail, like in the bridge right there. If you can see that, the bridge right there and the, all the different peaks and stuff. I got this one much bigger than all the rest of them because I knew there was going to be a lot of detail that you would lose if you didn't um, get it big. There's also, there's not just like a bunch of ones either, but there are 152 white bags. 
Oh, my heavens. Yep, so this one's a big one. So how about I go ahead and unwrap Ooh. Okay, so now I'm wondering, so I have multiple canvases in this one. Okay, so I'm going to put those aside too. So here is the 50 by 60, ooh, this got wrinkled, 50 by 60, there we go. Um, I can see through the back of it, 50 by 60. Hogwarts Castle. I am a little worried about this big wrinkle right here, if you can see that. I'm gonna see what's underneath here. Oh man, that's a big one. That's gonna be a problem. Darn it. Well, the problem with that is that I'm going to have to really make sure that when I put it under my mattress, it is super, super, super flat and not crinkled at all so I can try to flatten this out. Darn it. That sucks. Let's try to push it out, but ugh. That is really disappointing. I'm just worried that it's going to, um, that the glue is not going to hold and the beads are going to push up and just not going to look right and it's not going to stay. Hopefully with being under my mattress for a while, hopefully it'll come out. But man, and over here got really damaged. I don't know. My thumbnail on this on this thumb broke. So <laughs> it's hard to uh un Cover the paper. All right, so here's the other side of that. Okay, lots of white. Um, like I said, there are a lot of versions of this one. There's like a purple, blue color scheme. There's a um. I think there's even more of like a rainbow-ish type version as well. Um, but this one, I like this one because with the mix of all my other colors, I just liked how bright it was. Um, I really liked how bright it was, so I wanted to try it. Okay, so I'm also worried over here that, um, <clears throat> that this this paper won't be flush with the glue and then it'll dry. That's the other thing I'm worried about. Right here. So I'm gonna try to pull it. I'm sorry you guys, you probably don't wanna watch me do this, but does anyone else have any tips on how to mend something like this? Okay, there we go. I'm just worried that it's going to, you know, pop up and not seal correctly. And then over here I see a gap between the paper. Oh boy, not too happy about that, but all right, we'll have to see. All right, and then this one... There's, I think, three canvases here, so there should be, I don't know why I have, unless this one is just all beads, or drills, I mean. I'm going to, 
open this one. Oh yeah, okay. Wow, this box completely came apart. <laughs> All right, so I've got three more basic trays, bags, pens, tweezers, wax. This is really dusty. Wow, okay. There they are. That's why they were taped up together like that. Okay. So this one is the Hogwarts Crest. It's like a rainbowy um, Hogwarts Crest and it says, um, it has all the different um, houses inside of it. And then, you know, the words. I forget what that means. Draco, Dormians, some Memquam, Titolandus. I don't know. I forget what that means. I used to know what that means. Okay, there's 24 colors in this one. These are all full square, by the way. All full square um, drills. Um, there's 59 um, off-white. It's not truly white. So this one uses the off-white color. <coughs> Excuse me, the 3865 instead of the 5200. So at least that's a little different, right? Ooh, and look at this pretty color. It's like a very, very light. I don't know if you can see that. Very, very light blue bluish green color. You know, I'm not really good with the names of different colors, so you know, bear with me. If you have a better name for the color, you can imagine it in your head. <laughs> I'm not really sure. All right, so I'm so excited. I got all my Harry Potter pictures today. That's so awesome. All right, so let's do um, oh, Let's look at that canvas because I'm not sure how big it was. Um, so this, not that one. Oh, no. Sorry, you guys. I'm just trying to. This might have to be broken up into two videos, to be honest, because I don't want to have it go too long. Oh wow, you guys! This I'm so excited. I got all my Harry Potters. They're all here. <laughs> okay, so this one is a 30 by 40. Yeah, it's a 30 by 40. And it doesn't look too wrinkled, too bad. It, it does have a couple little bubbles, but that's just from being rolled up and then flattened again. So... Yeah, those, that looks really nice. You can see that. Looks really nice. I'm really excited to do these. I didn't, I kind of thought for a second about all the white when I was ordering them, but my love for Harry Potter trumped it all and I said, who cares? I want them. So I'm glad that they're going by fast and it's not tedious work because that wouldn't be fun. Symbols look really good. I don't know if you're going to necessarily be able to read these words down here, but that's, that's okay. There's a, I mean, you get it. You get what it is, right? Okay. So next, let's go with this one. I think I'll be able to do one more and then I'll have to do the rest in another video, you guys. Okay, so this one is the always quote. It says always on it. It's 38 colors. It's a 30 by 40 again. And it has the Deathly Hallow symbol with the... Um, Stag and the doe, which are, um, or is it, yeah, 
that, that's Snape's Patronus, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure if it's Lily's too. I think it is Lily's and James Potter, so they're, they're um, Patronuses are there. And if you're not familiar with what a Patronus is, it's this, the spell that gets the bad Dementors to go away. It's like a positive aura. And um, lots of 3D vibes again. And they take different forms depending on what, who you are, you know. So someone else had a bunny um, Patronus and it's just like this light figure. And so um, that's that one. And let me get the canvas out really fast for you. <clears throat> After this one, I've got um, three more, no, two more to show you. No, three more to show you. Yeah, three more to show you. All right, so this is the always. This one is horizontal. This one goes like this way. And da, 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 da. oh, that's gonna be awesome! Look at that. Oh, that is gonna in all these colors are just gorgeous. If you're a Harry Potter fan and a diamond painting fan, you really need to search for um, Harry Potter diamond paintings because there's a lot of them out there. These are all from AliExpress. I'm just gonna do that over here. Again, doing this helps to flatten them out enough so that they're not rolling up on you every chance they get. It's really hard to put something that keeps rolling under your bed. <laughs> under your mattress, I mean. All right, so I'm really excited. I think this one's gonna be amazing. I love all the colors. Um, I love that it's not really dark because as, you, as some of you might know, Harry Potter, um, a lot of the Harry Potter pictures and posters and things are very dark. So I'm really glad that these are so colorful. Um, there it is again. <coughs> Excuse me, you guys, sorry. All right, so um, I'll bring out these three in another video. Thanks for watching.